Okay, it's me again, it's Melanie, and I just wanted to share a brief word with you um, that was impressed upon my spirit today as I was um, uh, going about my usual order of business. Um, also, when we're in the service business where we, a lot of our business is based on how well we serve our customers and how we interact with them and whether we're dotting every I and crossing every T, we often feel the need to impress or um, just do a really good job. And a lot of times there's a, there's a lot of strain put on you to, to perform. Um, and so the parallel came to my mind between how that, that dynamic plays out in business as well as how it plays out in real life, like uh, everyday life. And I was thinking about how very often we become people pleasers. We find ourselves trying to uh, live up to what people expect of us. We'll deny our own desires. We'll deny sometimes even what God desires for us to do and to be um, based on how people react to it. And so I want to encourage you today to focus on an audience of one, God. Um, He's supreme in our lives, or supposed to be supreme in our lives anyway. So <clears throat> don't feel like you have to um, live up to some high standards or um, too many standards or too many um, requests that people are making and pulling on you and tugging on you. Just be yourself. Just try to be the best at what you do. Try to be authentic in who you are. And God will be pleased when you put him first when you're um, about your father's business, when you're doing what he commands you to do, which is basically to love um, him above all, to love people um, above yourself. Of course, he wants you to love yourself, but his God is all about serving, loving him supremely, loving others. And that's the example that he set for us. So just remember, um, you're not gonna please all the people all the time. It's impossible. You're one person. You can't do that. Just try to do the best that you can with what you have and who you are. Okay, so um, enjoy the rest of your day. It's about, it's uh, not quite noon today. Um, but I just wanted to drop that um, drop that line in with you today. And hope it hope it blesses you and I hope, hope it opens your eyes. Until next time, have a beautiful, blessed, and productive day. Bye-bye.